Hey, welcome back to the channel. Today, I'm going to show you how to install Comfy UI Desktop. Let's dive right in. So, if you want the beta version of Comfy UI, first head over to comfyi.org. Go to the download section, enter your email, and make sure to check the box that says, I've previously used Comfy UI. Then click join the waitlist. After a couple of days, uh, you should get an email with a link to download the desktop version. Once you get the email, uh, you'll be able to download either the Windows or Mac version. For this video, I'm going to show you how to install it on Windows. After downloading, run the installer. You'll be asked where you want to install it. I recommend saving it in your documents folder. Click next once you've selected your location. Next, you'll have the option to migrate your data if you've used ComfyUI before. If not, just click next again. Now you'll see options for auto updates and crash reporting. Keep those checked and click install. The installer will start by setting up a Python environment. It will activate that environment and install the library's Comfy UI needs to run. It's pretty much the same as the old installation, but now it's even easier because you get an X file. So even if you're not super tech, you can follow along. Once the installation is done, Comfy UI will start automatically. You'll see the Comfy UI manager screen pop up, meaning the main node is installed. Right now, it's installing the custom nodes. And yep, we're on the beta version with Python 3.12 now that it's up and running. Let's look at the features. It's very similar to the web version. You can open workflows, manage your nodes and install any missing ones. Super easy. One thing to note, there's no option right here in the interface to choose your graphics card. But you can always open the DevTools folder for advanced settings if you need them. In the workflow section, uh, you'll find templates for things like image generation, image to image conversion, and upscaling. Uh, you can work on multiple workflows at once in different tabs. Once you've got everything set up, you can save your workflow and even use the terminal to install additional tools if needed. If you want to share your workflow with others, you can upload it to, to the Comfy UI website and share it with the community. And that's it for today's video. Now you know how to install Comfy UI desktop and start working on your projects. If you like the video, don't forget to like and subscribe for more tutorials like this one.